good. Listen up the spine. Good. Put the hands together and then we're gonna stir the soup nice and big. What are we cooking today? I've been doing loaves and fishes, voluntary, for about since 1975. I come in and I fill up the steam table of hot uh, water, turn it on, and maybe get, get the boxes of vegetables out of the refrigerator, open them up, put them in a pan, and Linda the cook gets here, gets, puts them in the oven, and there's a vegetable or dessert to put in little plates. There's, uh, I can't think of salads, just about anything. Livermore and I've been volunteering with Loaves and Fishes, Meals and Wheels, gosh, for probably almost 12 years. And I primarily started because my grandfather was receiving Meals and Wheels in uh, one of the in the neighborhood. And when he passed away, I kind of did that as an immemorial to him. This is my third boy um, that's been with me. I have two other ones that grew up doing this with me. And so we've been doing it for you know all that time. So it's been fun. Hi, my name is Marcus Lampros and I've been delivering Meals on Wheels for nearly 20 years now. About 20 years ago I was at a neighborhood meeting here in Selwood and I met a uh, person named Thelma Skelton. Thelma was my inspiration. She told me at that meeting to show up and she would fix me up with uh, delivering Meals on Wheels on a Monday. And I thought to myself, you know, I can do that for one Monday. And next thing you know, I turned around and it was 20 years later. Meals on Wheels is very easy and very fast to do. At, at lunchtime, uh, you just hop in your car, you pick up your coolers, and you make a difference in a neighborhood uh, where you live or where you work. Of all the meals I've delivered you in 12 years, you open it up and you're surprised. Which one do you just love the most? Well, the meatloaf? Meat, meatloaf. And... We got meatloaf today. Good. I know, I knew that. Yeah, that's wonderful. I hope they don't take you away from me. Well, I don't know if I get, you know, offered a better job. Oh, well. <laughs> no, I'm not being paid. No, just tell them you don't want it. <laughs> I don't. I wouldn't, I wouldn't stop delivering to you, and they'd have to drag me out of here, so it's been great, so. I enjoy having you come by. <laughs>